thinking long term with your customer, you've you've got to basically. I, I've always said, you know, the, the move from an LO, a loan officer, broker, to an advisor, to a person that provides SLA, stays connected to the customer, is a big move. You could do it contractually. You don't have to just get paid on the mortgage itself. You can get paid to do services, and right. you just have to you just have to list what those services are. And I actually think I call it optimizing sales uh, through really a, a focus on analytics driven retention right which is i think what you're talking about so if, if you're an lo today and you pivot to purchase which is big and relationships and you focus on these analytics right i think then you begin to optimize the customer relationship and you've got to have more products and more services the challenge for loan officers really is the the void between the purchase or the refinance and the next deal so I've always, like you, stayed focused on how can I reimagine and lever that relationship in a way that you, the loan officer, can optimize this borrower, right? Your tagline, no borrower left behind, is a good one, right? Because you you really want to, uh, it is military, right? You don't want to leave them in the battlefield. And we go back and get everybody we can. So I stay focused on trying to figure out products and services that allow us to stay connected, right? Uh -huh in that void in that period of, of what did dave uh, matthews matthews song it's the space in between and it's a tough space right if you've got this void that exists and you know if you're a bank or or you have something where there's some repetitive whether you have a credit card or something like that there's a, there's a constant use how do we stay connected and yet we do a whole bunch of things to not right we sell your servicing you don't really know who we are we don't call you we're busy with our new originations so we don't focus on it and there's a lot i think dave to unpack in that for companies that are really serious about it because you've got to really look at my contracts my agreements with my loan office how my loan officers get paid, how I store data, what we want them to do on an ongoing basis. I mean, we all want them to go out right now and get new customers. Is that the best use? Shouldn't you go back in first and look at all your existing customers and see what they want to do? Because they have so much equity and so much, I mean, that would be the lowest hanging.